Earlier this week, we had the pleasure of watching the premiere of Eckhart Tolle's Milton's Secret. This family-friendly movie takes the Native American story of the two wolves who live inside us, or many of Aesop's fables, and updates them to a message that speaks to our modern age. Here's why I like this message. Instead of two wolves, lions and bulls, two crabs, birds, beasts, and bats, or whatever cast of characters have been used in the same story from the past, Eckhart moves the story completely away from the realm of you, those, and them. All words that only serve to increase our frustration and negativity towards things. This story speaks of civil war, not the one fought in the 1800s, not the one we speak of in the news today, the one we fight inside ourselves. Think about that for a moment. The word civil is an adjective. Although it has several meanings, the one we are discussing today is the most important of all. Courteous and polite, as in, we were civil to him. We were polite, courteous, well-mannered, gracious, respectful, civilized, cordial, pleasant, decent, and mannerly. How often do you find yourself having a civil war with yourself? As you scroll through your social media feed, as you read the news, as you get into a political discussion, as your frustrations mount over the upcoming holidays and how your plans on how to spend them are going to look different this year. Remember, as that Native American story about the two wolves pointed out, whichever emotion you feed is the one that will grow. Take good care to feed the part of you that is civil and kind. As Margaret Thatcher once said, you may have to fight a battle more than once to win it. In this case, practice makes perfect and the civil war inside each one of us can be won over and over again each and every day. I believe in you. My name is the Reverend Kathy Crosby, and there you have it, short and sweet.